What's up guys, welcome to our journey. In today's video, we are going to be doing a Q&A. You guys asked a bunch of questions on TikTok and we're here to answer them. Do you want to say anything? I'm Brielle and this is Carson and we're getting married this year. Uh, yes, we are. Subscribe if you're not already. Let's start this Q&A. Let's just start it off. Let's just go. Let's just go for it. We don't got to talk for five minutes. You know? When will the tiny home be done? I'm going to say in a few months. I'm going to say like June-ish. Really? June. When we started? It's gonna take us a whole year to build? Yeah, maybe. Maybe, possibly. Like, I'm saying, like, the to, like, middle of the year. Fully done? To be completely yeah, like, done? Like okay. Middle of the year. Okay. Most I'll go to August. Okay. The next question is How old are we? I am 21. I was born in 1999, believe it or not. I am 19, and my birthday is in two months. So, when in I two proposed. months, I'm gonna be 20. And. I'm not gonna be a teenager anymore. <laughs> and I still look like I'm 12. Yeah. That's okay. I was born in 2001. Some people might think that that's weird that, like, he was born in 1999. And I'm. It sounds weird. Yeah. But it's like we're like a year and, and a like half -ish. seven months, I think it is, um, apart. So it's not quite it's like not. two years. But when you say 2001 and then 1999, yeah. you think it's, it's, two years apart. Yeah. it's weird. It makes me seem like but I'm he's so at old. the end of the year. Like he barely made it. He was almost okay. Almost I still made it. I still made it. I'm a 90s baby. <laughs> You know, for a month. I was literally a 90s baby for a month. Mm -hmm. My birthday's in uh, November 16th. Are you guys going to have kids in the future? Yes. Yes. A hundred and trillion ten percent. One yes. thousand percent. They're yes. going to look just like me. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I just wanted to say that because I have that. It's not a bad thing. I want them to have your dimples. Okay. I want them to have your curly hair. Okay. I want them to have... You want them to have this craziness? I want them to have... I want them to have your eyelashes. What? No. <laughs> your eyelashes are better because yours actually curl up. Mine mine go I down like this. Yeah, but they're cute. <laughs> I don't even know if you like can see them. Like your eyes. I just like your eyes. I okay. Well, I, oh, like your, I, I like your eyes, have, though. I would have your mole. I don't know. Okay, she okay. crazy. Okay. When did you guys know you were meant for one another? This is such a hard question because I feel like we just knew. I'm trying to when think. When did you really know that I was the one? When you met me in person? Like, when I met her in person, my heart, like, yeah. dropped. And I was just like, I want this forever. Like, I literally, it was so funny. Last night, I was when I was talking to God, I literally prayed to God. I was like, I want that same feeling that I had when I first met you. Mm -hmm. And when I proposed to you, like, how we feel about each other and, like, how I felt about you. I want that feeling all the time with yeah. you. You know, like, yeah. I feel like when we get married, it's going to be like that again. Mm -hmm. And I feel like slowly the fire tries to dim out with, like, you know, worldly things. But there's nothing like the feeling of like being in love you know and i don't know it's just it's it's indescribable how long have we known each other <laughs> oh. known each other since 2013 yeah the first so time we've seen each other well, we've been knowing each other for eight years mm -hmm. well almost eight because years because i think in june, june in will june make, eight we'll make eight years because oh my god the first time i seen carson he didn't see me so technically we both didn't see each other yeah. both didn't like we know. didn't meet each other but it was like a few weeks after yeah but the first time I seen Carson was June 1st, 2013. That's the first time she ever seen me dance mm -hmm. on stage and she fell in love with me. Yep. She was a fangirl. No. Yes, you are. Don't lie. You can say it. It's okay. Okay. A little bit? Just give me a little yeah, bit. Yeah, like... Okay, a like, little I, bit. Okay, okay, okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah, like, I wanted, I wanted to just, like, talk <laughs> Meet me to and him. talk with me. Yeah. yeah. Like, you just, like, knew something. The fun fact, like, some people might not know is... Carson started dancing right after Michael Jackson died. So did she. And I did the same thing. Like, on the news, Michael Jackson died, and both of our parents were, like, freaking out because mm -hmm. she's obviously iconic. My mom had, like, a concert DVD, and I would watch her, like, all the time, and I would do dances. Mm -hmm. There's literally and videos she, of me dancing, like, yeah. Michael Jackson, same with him, and I was way better and than And she Carson. was way better than me. Way better. The only difference is, is I stuck with dancing, mm -hmm. and she didn't, sadly. Yeah. But and, it's in her somewhere. But I think that when I seen Carson being the only boy on stage, it was like, it was kind of like that. Like, I was interested in it because I loved Michael Jackson and I loved, like, seeing that. And that was the first, like, male dancer that I'd seen besides him. Mm -hmm. Brielle just enjoys dancing in general. I can choreograph a dance and not even perform it myself. 
but the kids or the the people that I choreographed it for, she would want to go watch it. Mm -hmm. You know, just because it's dance. Like, I guess because I had something to do with it. But I'm just trying to make a point that, like, I don't have to be on stage for you to enjoy it. Mm -hmm. Or I don't have to be in the video for you to enjoy it. Well, no, even even Carson's, like, competition team, like, at Mm -hmm. competitions, it wasn't that I sat in the crowd just for me and only wanted to watch Mm -hmm. Carson. Like, I wanted to watch Mm -hmm. all of the dances, even if he wasn't in it. Fun fact, the girls that I dance with... When I proposed to her, those are all my friends on that was on competition team with me. So, yeah. Anyway, shout out to you guys. Uh, What's your dream vacation? I think anywhere with you. Yeah, I think anywhere. Like, I know that's really cliche I'm and like, oh, it's like you and they sent that. But it's like, seriously, anywhere with you. Like, because I've traveled a decent amount, like random mm-hmm. places and stuff. But it's so different when you travel with somebody that's like you love and like, cause you want to show them everything or like you want to experience the things together. Cause it's a different feeling. you could, you could see, you know, let's just use snowy, snowy mountain, you know, mm-hmm. like a snowy mountain, you know, a hundred times, but it's completely different when you go there with the love of your life or just like a person that you love or care about and experience with them because they might feel a different way or they're gonna feel a different way than you felt the first time or the first hundred times you know what I mean but, but let's let's like okay, really no, think I about really, it though yeah I think it would be like I feel like somewhere secluded I don't know because my I, mind's going to either like somewhere in like Europe someplace yeah. like that like mm-hmm. the feeling of like like London England something like that but at the same time like or I'm thinking of like like a stay away mountain oh really yeah the mountain what you were gonna say like a little like like a little, like a little nook little, somewhere. Yes, and in like either the mountains by a stream or yeah, something like that. So somewhere in Europe, basically. Oh, are you tired? Yeah, so we're in Europe. <laughs> New Year's goals. I think our New Year's goals is definitely planning the wedding. Mm-hmm. Um, and really making sure no matter what's going on in the world at the time of our wedding that we still make the most of it and... Because it's it's the main focus is us. It's just me and her. You know what I mean? And like making sure that we make that commitment. Like just making sure that it's just about me and you. And no matter what yeah, goes like on in the world. On that into... Like we can't stress about things that go on that's out of our control. That's it. Is the yeah. no kissing thing till marriage a joke? Uh <laughs> so this one's kinda on me. Um I just don't like to put our intimate relationship Mm -hmm. out in public that's why if you go look at uh some of our videos whenever i proposed to her at the end i literally we're just hugging it's not that necessarily that it's a joke it's just that i don't feel comfortable putting it that intimate relationship i guess on public at least not until we're married i mean i don't know how i'll feel when we're married because i'm even like nervous about kissing her like you may now kiss your bride at the wedding like that's i don't know why it's just me you feel that? No. No? Yeah, I don't know. It's just, I don't know why. No, I definitely, I'm not. I just hope I've that in that moment. Like, I've never been like an open person. Like, I don't like attention. I do not like You know what? He likes attention. <laughs> but the thing but is. But I like the right attention. I don't like yeah, that I know. attention. But the thing is, in that moment, like. Yeah, I think, I think in that moment. That's a moment yeah, where. It's, I'm not going to care about different. anything else. Yeah, like, you just. Like, it's yeah. just going to be me and you. And that's all that matters. There's lots like, of things I'm going to tune everything else yeah. out. There's lots of things in the wedding that people do that I don't want to do. Yeah, no, I know. At the wedding, I might be like, okay, do we kiss now? <laughs> I might do that and make it be like, I don't know. We'll see. It just, no, it's... because they say you kiss the bride and you're supposed to do it. You don't have time to like. No, no, I know. It's like, you may now kiss the bride and be like, you ready? I'm, I'm going to yeah. do that. I'm probably going to do that. <laughs> okay. Can we see picture ideas for the tiny home? That's all you. She kind of, she yeah, kind of. I'll, I'll like put stuff yeah. on the screen because I have a whole Pinterest board. Yeah, she stuff. has a whole Pinterest board. Not that I didn't have any say in it or like, it's not that I don't want say in it. It's just that she likes I'm to go make. I'm the one that created yeah. it, but we, we looked at it. In yeah, the, we looked at we it together. It, we put it in together. Are you guys waiting till marriage? We get this question so often and I don't know what it means. Waiting for what? Waiting till what? How tall are we? How tall are we? I am five nine, I think. Yeah, I'm five. Oh no! Not your five. I thought you were five, five ten. ten. I'm five ten. That's right. I forget. How tall are you? Five one. I'm five one and a half. Okay, and a half. I'll give you the half, I guess. Okay. She's she's the adorable, cute size. Let's just say that. She fits perfectly right here. When she were standing up, it just looks like she's kind of the same height though, because my torso so dang mm-hmm. short. Literally, like we're sitting at the same height basically right now. Yeah. <laughs> I have yeah. such a short torso, but I have long legs. Mm-hmm. Anyway. I'm kind of even. 
<laughs> you know, you're po- yeah, you're you're <laughs> you're equally proportioned. Yeah. Last but not least, how, how do, do we meet? meet? <laughs> okay, so many people ask us this. I feel like we've said it so, we've many, said times, it so many times, but it's okay. Now you have in one video a bunch of answers and questions about us. Okay, anyway, how we met was kind of what we said a little bit earlier in the video that Brielle seen me dance on stage. She fell in love with me, but this is where it gets interesting. She found me on Instagram a few weeks later. Somehow, a few. I thought I thought it was like the next day, but yeah, she says it's ta- a few he weeks. He was tagged in that picture, and I was like, "That's she was like, Oh my that's god, you. that's him!" And so she commented on my Instagram, and I wasn't gonna give her my number because I didn't know if she was real or not. Because like you know, I didn't want to get catfished. So I was like, "Here's my kick," <laughs> and we kicked for a little bit. If you guys don't know what a kick is, it's like this messaging social media free app Mm -hmm. it's because instagrams didn't have dms at the time yeah that's how long ago it was instagrams did not have dms because i commented on a picture because a little thing uh, that we didn't mention is i videoed him uh, on my phone like i had a video and then i told him i was like you sound like it's creepy okay anyway no because you're saying you're not a fangirl but you videoed me just saying okay because i thought it was good anyway so i took a video and then i commented on his picture and i was like hey i seen you guys on i actually have a video of you well this dude over here likes the whole camera action no logo. no that's not why i looked at your profile and i thought you were really cute so i was like this is my way to, to like get in talk with you okay even though we're really young i know i have moves okay anyway <laughs> oh my god so i felt cool. like he could trust me and then <laughs> Well, we no, the only way I could see the video was oh, if yeah. I sent you my number. So you're like, I need your number in order to send you the video. I was like, oh, because I guess you couldn't send videos on kick. You yeah, could you just talk. It. And then. So I had to give her my number. And, and sure enough, we, we started FaceTiming and stuff. Yeah, and she we, wasn't, she was just as pretty as she was on her I Instagram was profile. Was she was real. Catfish. She was not no catfish. And we she was FaceTime beautiful. on and off. We ended up stopping. I don't really know why. Just like time just got life, away. You know? And then. Like, a year later, we got back in touch. We'd, like, talk for a little bit, and then... We just kept in touch, yes. like, throughout, then, like, throughout, what, like, a three, four-year period. Yeah. And then... And then finally, I was, so like... So, that was about, like, four years of doing that, mm-hmm. and then, after that, four years ago, he has a whole story, so I want you to say it. Quickly, is, I was in a dark period in my life, and all this kind of stuff, I wasn't feeling myself, and all this kind of good stuff, so I was talking with God, and he was like, hey, yo, remember Brielle, and I was like, oh, yo, I do, and then I didn't have her number, though, but then all of a sudden, I pull out my phone, and her number was in my phone, I'm like, wait, how do I have her number, it was this weirdest thing ever, so then I try to text her, she never answered me back, so I was like, dang, but then... And long story short, we got in touch, and now we're a thing. And now we're getting married. But yeah, long story short, she found me on Instagram. We talked on and off for four years, and then boom, we made it official. And there you go. And the first time I met when she moved here, and we seen Medea's Abu Halloween. That was an extra little little saucy sauce. We hoped you enjoyed that. Um, that was a fun Q&A. We should do this more often. If you guys would like to know us even better, subscribe for all our future videos and to watch all our past videos and all that fun stuff because we are planning the wedding this whole year. So we're going to be coming out with a lot of videos. You know, she's going to be like wedding dress shopping. I'm going to be like whatever grooms do. Um, tasting cake. I want a chocolate cake. Um, trying foods. You know, all that fun stuff. So stay tuned for that and subscribe if you want to see all that fun stuff. Oh, and we're building a freaking house. Like, you could subscribe for that too if you guys want to see us building our first house. If you guys are here from TikTok, comment down below and say that you're from TikTok. If you're from Instagram, comment down below that you're from Instagram. And we will see you guys next time. And remember to keep Keep creating your your journey. journey. (laughs) You still don't like that thing. I don't know why you always laugh at that. You need to know how it feels when we're falling in love Say what you wanna say to me now I wanna wake up with you now Show me the way to me now I wanna wake up with you now Say what you wanna say to me now I wanna wake up with you now I feel like I already made that commitment <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm trying to be cute Sorry <laughs> <laughs> Um, let me think, no, I'm joking